Hey everyone, it's Jess, your host for Mondays on the Beaver Bunch, and this week I'm supposed to choose a topic from the list that you guys gave us on uh, on our Facebook, and it was really tough for me to pick just one, so I may actually grab just, just a few. I'm, I'm gonna do a, a, a grab bag of sorts and basically just see what I come up with. To, I wanted to talk about the one that I didn't choose that I absolutely would have chosen um, except for my Mondays are incredibly uneventful and so I didn't want to do a day in the life of and have it be this like incredibly boring video for you guys so at some point in the future I'm sure that I can get the rest of the beavers on board and will definitely take care of that suggestion. Oh. The first one that I wanted to answer had to do with where do you guys see yourself in 10 years? Um, I don't know exactly where I'll be but I would really really like to be paying um, uh, a mortgage. I would like to be I would like to own or be on my way to owning a home and I would like to be a little bit more traveled than I currently am. Hopefully Mary will still be somewhere in the picture with me that would be that would be ideal and uh, I don't know I, I don't have a specific place that I want to live or anything I just I want to be content and I want to know that I'm I'm still moving forward that the momentum in my life is still is still going forward I feel like the past couple years have really pushed me in very very specific directions in my life and I can only hope that, you know, by the time I'm almost 40 that I'll still be heading in the right direction. So, I don't know. What you manifest is before you. I, I live by that. Another one is if you if you could go back to a certain... I'm trying to remember these off the top of my head. If you could go back to a certain time period, such as the 1950s, who would you be and why? Um, I did a little bit of research and I would choose James Dean. Now, for those that, that don't know, James Dean was 24 when he died in a car crash. And it was in 1955, which, I mean, I, I think at this point he had made like three films, and basically he was just a cool dude. So I, I would choose James Dean for that. And then one other one, so I'll do three. Three sounds like a good number. Um, one other one, it said, it said being out in the workplace. Now, I don't know exactly what the question is, but as far as 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 far as I go, um, I'm absolutely out in my workplace. For those that don't know, I work for the LGBT Community Center, so they pretty much, you know, welcome you with open arms if you're gay or you know any any part of the LGBTQIA um, community. So I love my job. I think it's amazing and. Uh, you know, anybody that is out there looking for a job, there's nothing quite like being able to uh, express yourself and feel comfortable in your workplace. There are still plenty of states that can fire you for being gay, so uh, there's not a day that goes by that I don't appreciate my job and I never take it for granted. So that's it. That's my video. I hope you guys have a really great week, and hopefully I will catch you all next Monday. Bye, guys.